Hello folks, it's Ron back here at Ron Brown's YouTube channel. We talk a lot about uh, drones, action cameras, tech gear in general, but today's kind of going to be a drone video. I just want to kind of lay a roadmap out for what we expect from DJI consumer drones in 2025. I'm not really going to touch on Enterprise much here. At the end, I'll talk about some non-drone uh, non, non consumer devices from DJI also. But let's start off. We've already, the, shoe, the first shoe's already dropped this year. Uh, last week, uh, about the middle of January, we got the DJI uh, Flip Drone. It's a kind of a uh, maybe a better version of the Neo. It's a selfie drone. You can launch it from the palm of your hand, fly it with a phone, kind of get those social media vlogging type shots or whatever. Came out retailing for about four thirty nine in a base kit. That's a drone controller and a battery, and uh, you know it seemed to be uh, pretty much available. Most people would have got it within about three days from DJI. I did see it was on Amazon.com. All so, so that's the that's the first drone of the year and the next drone we expect is the mavic 4 series and uh, you know, recent rumors say the drone could be coming soon maybe february march other people say it's not coming until almost summer you know late spring early june uh and an, an, another thing people uh, are confused about whether we're getting a mavic 4 or a mavic 4 pro both um it's you know it's a lot of leaked pictures on the uh, internet from people such as Jasper Allen's and, and Igor uh, uh, Igor B, B I'll call him I don't know if exactly say his last name they're both big on Twitter with the leaks both come up with some good leaks and they've had they have some really good pictures of what the proposed Mavic Four is right now so just check their sites you can see all sorts of pictures it's kind of a different looking drone that we've seen before some people say it's ugly. You know, uh, I, I the beholder type of thing, but uh, they're talking about it having uh, 100 megapixel photos. Um, you know, uh, the, is a 6K resolution. Uh, just you know, just some really you know uh, out there specs. Uh, we don't have really any pricing yet. Uh, some people speculated it won't cost much more than the Mavic 3, but we'll, we'll see on that. So uh, yeah, and, and the, I guess the big thing is is it. Uh, what's with the Mavic 3? I'm gonna back up here. The Mavic 3, what they did is release the Mavic 3 first, and then like a year or more later, they came out with a, a Mavic 4 Pro that had like that, that third camera. It's actually the, the more useful of the two long cameras. It kind of disappointed a lot of people that had put all their money into the, the Mavic 3 thick, and that was it. And the Mavic 3 Classic was released actually before the Mavic uh, Pro, whatever, which had only one camera. But anyhow, this time around, we just don't know what's happened. A lot of people just like to see the Mavic 4 Pro come first, or the Mavic 4 Pro and the Mavic 4 come at the same day or whatever, and then you can decide right away which one you want, rather than buying once and then down the road have to buy again because the drone you really want didn't come until a year, year or more later. So, uh, you know, that, that's one of the big thoughts here is with, with, let's hope they put all the cards on the table at the beginning, or at least the most, the best card put the the pro version out right away so yeah we, we so we expect that so we're in a time frame of uh we'll say you know uh late winter uh all the way up to late spring somewhere in that well we'll say anywhere from february to early june is, is when we expect that to come but you know sometimes there are delays sometimes things come faster you, you just never know so okay after that there's also these are all you know, rumors that are out there after that uh, in the late summer early fall period so we'll say second half of august september maybe even early october you know in that area we expect to see maybe uh, a mini 5 pro um you know of course it'll that have been two years since the mini 4 pro came out so it was due a lot of people speculated that the flip would take the place of the of the mini 4 pro or the mini series but i don't think so the flip's kind of a different beast uh it's not really the replacement for the mini 4 pro even though it has a, the almost the same camera or similar camera and uh so um, yeah a lot of people think that that mini that mini line drones will continue on with it with the mini 5 mini 5 pro and also in that same time frame we're also expecting to see a um the neo 2 which people hope with a much better camera on it uh, at that point. So both of those, we see that coming out in, in kind of the, in that late summer, kind of early mid fall period. And uh, that's kind of all the drones that are rumored, consumer drones that are rumored from DJI at this point. Now that doesn't mean that out of nowhere it won't pop up like an Air 4 
or a, um, a, a, Ma uh, yeah, a Mavi, and a Vada 3, you know, something like that could, could pop up out of there. And again, we could get two, two uh, you know, Mavic 4 drones, or maybe even three, who knows? They could, on the, if they were smart, they'd release a Mavic 4 Pro, Mavic 4, and a Mavic uh, 4 Classic all, maybe all at the same time or whatever. So, uh, yeah, so that, that's kind of what we're, you know, we're looking at in, in DJI drone, consumer drone releases. We, they've already released a Matrice, um, but again, we're not really going to talk about enterprise drones here. So, uh, okay, on to non-drone devices. Um, there's been a lot of rumors about uh, a 360 camera and on also a na nano series camera, like a small camera, maybe, you know, even smaller than what the Action 2 used to be. So, um, and those rumors have been, you know, kind of on and off for months now. So, um, I expect to see maybe both those cameras maybe released sometime in 2025. And of course, in that, in that late summer, fall period, fully expect a, a DJI Action 6 to come out, Action 6, 6 Pro. I mean, DJI has, you know, since the Action 3, 4, and now 5 Pro, they've hit that that same, you know, August, September schedule for their action cameras, kind of to keep up with DJI. And even it's the 360 now, they have that Ace, Ace Pro series, Ace Pro 1 and 2 going out. And even they, they have come out a little bit later, late fall. Um, they're still consistently coming out, like in that, in that same end of the year time frame too. So I uh, fully expect they, Action six. So um, that's just kind of a timeline, just of what we know in rumors so far. I mean, again, there could be things coming out that 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 have you know were their top secret. Nobody knows anything about. The leaks haven't got out, so we just don't know. But that's the kind of things we we kind of do have heard about already. Seen a lot of rumors and so on about. So oh yeah, hope this helps you out in some way. Again, this what I'm telling you is all rumors, leaks, speculation. None of this is based on any. Fact, I, I haven't had any contact with DJI or anybody associated with DJI in any way. So this is this all gathered, you know, on, on the internet, all this information. So, yeah. So um, if you got anything out of this video, give me the thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't already uh, uh, subscribed to the channel, please subscribe, ring that bell so you see more videos like this. And, yeah, thanks for watching, folks, and uh, we'll see you on the next video.